All right, so a little update. The uh, F650 project, obviously the motor's out, so he decided to go ahead and rebuild it. Um, we got her all stripped down. I was just pressure washing the shop because it was freaking filthy after we got the motor out and flipped over and can't stand that. So what we wound up getting was a nice cat remand. There it is. And uh, this one's got, it's hard to pick up because the machining's really well which I would hope Caterpillar machine something, but you can see right there, it's got sleeves in it. This motor's been bored and they put the sleeves in it, but everything's back to OEM spec. So we got that. I think Cat wanted like $5,600 for that. I found it still in the Cat crate. Um, guy bought it, never used it, I guess. So I got it for quite a bit less. So before I pressure wash this thing, because I'm not hauling it out of here like that. It, uh, there you can see cylinder walls all tore up just, just on the one side, except for number five. Number five is perfect. Cross hatching, everything's good. And I'll show you why in just a second. But everything else looked good when we pulled it apart. Again, it's got 119,000 on it. Cam bearings looked good. Uh, the new blocks got those already in it, but there's there was no real damage. There's a little bit of wear on certain ones, but nothing nothing strange. And so everything will go in the new block uh, from the rebuild kit. Um, the only thing we will be reusing is the crank cam and connecting rods everything else is uh is brand new new pistons all that well the cylinder head will do valve stem seals uh, i'm gonna do injector cups uh, all that good stuff there's the old main caps the new motor comes with new caps and bolts uh here's cylinder five as you can see here's our broken piston rings from all the other cylinders, but cylinder five, the, the piston ring was still good, but I believe it was getting ready to break because you can see there was a lot of blow by getting by there. But anyhow, yeah, we, uh, oh, where's the, there's the head bolts, brand new cat head bolts. And they're big suckers, but they're a torque to yield bolt. I mean, as big as that thing is, you would think it could be reused, but they say no, so that's what we go by. And we will not reuse um, the connecting rod bolts. We got new ones coming. Uh, the main cap bolts, there's already new ones with the new block, the reman block. So, yeah, we're just kind of trying to clean up in here and organize a little bit because we've been busting but get the thing out and tore down i'm gonna pressure wash it and i got some parts off the truck that need to be pressure washed it was all just just soaked with oil but we got it out good uh good job to do here in the big old in this big pole barn it's old you know we got Little tractor over there and a four wheeler and stuff, but this side's concrete and works out good. So, I'll show you when uh, we get some of the engine stuff going.